Hey everyone, I'm here with a story that's been stirring up quite the drama over in Palawan, Philippines. Imagine being officially unwelcome in an entire province. Well, that's exactly what happened to social media personalities, Raz Martan, Rendon Labador, and their group, Team Malacas. Let's dive into what went down. Recently, the local government of Palawan passed a resolution, and not just any resolution. This one declared Rosmar, Rendon, and their entire team persona non grata across the province. Yep, that means they are officially not welcome. So what sparked this drastic decision? It all started when Team Malakas visited Koran for an outreach event. Sounds harmless, right? But things quickly took a turn. The mayor's office staff member, Joe Kayabyab Trinidad, accused the team on social media of using the local people for their vlog content. This didn't sit well with Rosmar and Rendon, leading to a fiery exchange in the mayor's office. Palawan 1st District Board Member Juan Antonio Alvarez weighed in, saying that while Trinidad's Facebook complaint might have been a personal rant, the reaction from Team Malacas was over the top. He mentioned that distributing aid doesn't give anyone the right to disrespect the locals. The resolution described Rendon Labador's behavior as disrespectful, inappropriate, and showing a blatant disregard for proper decorum. As for Raz Martan, she was accused of causing undue distress and embarrassment to the mayor's office. This duo's actions, it seems, reflected negatively on the office they represented. This incident raises a lot of questions about the role of social media influencers and their interactions with local communities, especially during outreach missions. Are they there to help, or is it just for the clicks and views? And at what point does an influencer's behavior cross the line? Whatever the answers may be, one thing is certain. In Palawan, actions and respect seem to go hand in hand, and crossing that line can lead to some serious consequences. I'm curious to hear your thoughts on this. Drop a comment below and let's discuss the impact of social media personalities on local communities. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on intriguing stories like this one. Until next time, stay informed and engaged.